there's like five core outcomes that I've seen able to do within just the large language models. Now there's a lot of different modalities, but large language models is like Bard or chat GPT just to make it super simple. And so there's five areas. One is like how to turn something that used to take me hours and get it done in minutes, uh, built out a whole sales department in 20 minutes, which would previously take about eight hours. So that was one of the things uh, in terms of business acumen or like long-term skill development, there was things that took almost like a decade to learn from live experience. And just by asking the right questions, did that in days or actually seconds, uh, automated outcomes. I know Scott just mentioned that there's, there are some amazing capabilities that are time sucks on the, the, <laughs> the existence of life and then skills in seconds as well. Um, what I mean by that is I never had the capability to be good at graphics and I leveraged mid journey and was creating amazing work on something that I had no capacity to do before. And last but not least with code interpreter being released on demand analysis. Basically that's having an on staff analyst and it's only in beta with chat GPT, but basically you could upload a CSV file and get a complete data analysis and have almost like a data scientist on staff to deconstruct trends and patterns that you see in data. So those are like the five core use cases that I'm seeing right now um, amongst many, many others. Yeah, and and just a, a quick one, Ryan. How has it been? How how is the reception of it when you're working with uh, with your customers? Yeah, it's it's good. So I mean, like I would say it's amazing. Like the the biggest epiphany that folks have is when they do something, and like it's not just my customers. I've used it with with even like executives in other industries, right? And showed them what's possible. And then once they understand what's possible, then the wheels start spinning in their head. I think. One of the biggest challenges, most people don't even know what's possible. They just hear all the hype train and the prompt bombs that happen. And so then they're just like, <laughs> they, they don't go anywhere with it. But once you actually start using like tactical use cases, then that's when people get super excited, whether it be a customer, a friend, acquaintance or, or whatever.